He really didn't look real. He looked like a stuffed animal. He looked like a plush toy. I think he weighed like two pounds and that's so tiny for a little lamb. He was like this big. And his brothers and sisters were like this big. His size scared me a lot. I didn't know what to expect. The farmer called us and said that he had a sheep who had triplets and one of the three babies was getting rejected. This little runt was getting weaker by the hour. His mom just didn't have enough to give to him and the two stronger siblings were pushing Flick out of the way. He's a good boy. I wanted him to feel like he was part of a flock, like he had family. Flick, get crazy! Whoa! It was a roller coaster with him. The first two weeks were hard, then he got very strong. Then I was worried again because he kept running a fever. I knew that if I just gave him extra love and attention, he would have more motivation to fight to live. Are you hungry? Okay, good sign. At like four-ish weeks old, he started to ram into our legs like hard. And I was like, oh, he's fine. He's a funny baby. Yes, you are. As a newborn, he didn't have much of a personality. Once he started to realize that we were his family, that's kind of when he showed his true colors. Oh, I just farted! He's so strange. You ready for your afternoon vacuum? Yeah, your favorite thing. My husband always says, all of our orphans are weird because you raised them. And I'm like, I know that I'm weird, but I'm not as weird as Flick. What are you doing? And he just looks like a fuzzy slug. Look into his eyes. You tell me he's not one of the weirdest creatures that you've ever come in contact with. Now that he's a teenager and he's older, he's still Weird, he likes sucking on things. I don't know why. The wheelbarrow, the pitchforks. You think that he's like chewing, but he's not. He's like sucking and he was like slobbering on it. You're not very helpful. <laughs> he was scared of them when he first met them. But after the first night, we woke up the next morning to all three of them cuddling together. <laughs> Within a few days, Flick was the leader for sure. I thought he was going to be timid. I thought that he was going to be scared all the time. But no, he is a big, brave dog. He's thriving. Started from the bottom, now we're here. That's him. He's just such a cool little dude. <laughs>